In young, non-lactating females experiencing breast tenderness, ultrasound imaging can reveal specific characteristics indicative of fibroadenosis. The breast parenchyma often exhibits a heterogeneous glandular texture, which can result in a nodular or lumpy appearance on imaging. This variation arises from dense fibroglandular tissue, leading to areas of increased echogenicity, which can serve as vital indicators for diagnosis. Another noticeable feature is the presence of dilated ducts. These ducts, particularly in the retroareolar region, may appear prominent or mildly dilated, occasionally filled with fluid or debris. This ductal prominence is significant in the context of fibrocystic changes and is often linked to the accompanying tenderness experienced by the patient. In this case study, this finding was markedly prominent. The formation of small, simple cysts is also common presenting as round or oval structures that are anechoic, black, on ultrasound, exhibiting posterior acoustic enhancement. Some cysts might contain internal echoes if debris is present, further suggesting active processes within the breast tissue. Rather than showing a distinct mass, fibroadenosis typically lacks a well-defined focal lesion, distinguishing it from fibroadenomas and other conditions. In some cases, there may be diffuse increased vascularity on color Doppler imaging, especially in areas symptomatic of pain or inflammation. These ultrasound findings, combined with the patient's hormonal background and symptomatology, guide clinicians toward a benign diagnosis, often managed conservatively through pain relief and lifestyle modifications. Regular follow-up is essential to monitor any changes in symptoms, 